Hey guys, welcome back to Shade Review. In today's video, we are reviewing the Maui Gym Flowing C Sunglasses. So first off, let's go ahead and pop the sunglasses on face and talk about the dimensions. They have 53 millimeter lenses and a 22 millimeter bridge. The frames are mostly made out of titanium, which of course is an extremely lightweight yet durable material. And the lenses in these frames are Maui Gym's Maui Brilliant Lenses, which are a third of the weight of Maui Gym's super thin glasses, which are already pretty lightweight to begin with, but the optical clarity of these is almost as good as super thin glass, they're just gonna be a tiny bit worse. So let's go ahead and pop these sunglasses back on and talk about some of the key details of these frames. The first thing we're gonna notice here is the painted on Maui Gym logo in the top right corner of the lens. The next thing we're gonna notice here is the top upper bridge. So as you guys can see here, there's this top little upper bridge and on the website, that was a flat bridge. It was just completely flat. But when they actually came in the mail, the top bridge sunglasses actually bends down. And I don't hate the look of that. I'm just curious to see what they'd actually look if the bridge was straight. I know it's really hard to tell right here. Let me try to focus here on the sunglasses, but you see the little bend on the website, it's not bent, it's straight. So I don't know if the quality control of mine wasn't quite up to where it should have been or what the deal is with that. But that's not the only weird thing about the top bridge of the sunglasses. The top bridge also is bendable. So you guys can see I'm actually moving it up and down right here. So it's actually made out of like a rubber material or something, some type of plastic rubber material. It's really weird. I'm not sure why Maui Jim did that. Clearly it's just for style and not actually you know, rigidity, usually you have double bridges here to make the frame stronger. But I think because Maui Jim used titanium on these frames, titanium is so strong that the center bridge here is all you really need to make these sunglasses really solid and nice. So they decided to go with this little flexible, uh, lightweight rubber material bridge to, yeah, cut down on the weight of them, but still add that double bridge look. So now, as far as the colorway goes on this particular pair of sunglasses, it's probably not a colorway you've actually seen before because I actually went ahead and customized them directly from Maui Jim. So they have Maui Jim's blue Hawaii lenses, and then the frames are Maui Jim's uh, matte gold titanium frame. So that's the uh, style that I decided to go ahead and customize. So I actually can't buy this pair of sunglasses off the shelf. If you want them, you have to customize them directly from Maui Jim's website. But that being said, I really do love this colorway. I think it looks really great with these frames and again, these blue Hawaii lenses look really, really sharp. Now, as far as hinges go, these sunglasses feature all metal hinges, which feel very good when open up and when closing them. They are very tight, probably the tightest pair of Maui Gym sunglasses hinges that I've ever you know, felt before. So they are very tight and you can kind of feel the frame bend a little bit as you bend them out. It has a little bit of flex to it because it's so tight. I personally would have them be a little less tight, but they're definitely not going anywhere. Even if you shake it, they're not going too fall in or anything like that. So they do feel premium and nice. I just think that Maui Jim tightened them up just a little bit too much. But of course, if you want to, you could always, you know, unloosen the hinge just a little bit and make them looser to your liking. If we take a look here closer at the front of the frames, we can see that there's actually something that surrounds the lens before it touches the titanium. And I believe that is a plastic material, made the same plastic material as this upper bridge. So it gives us this really cool, you know, three tone look because you have the lens, then the black frame that surrounds it and then the gold brush titanium frame here on the outside. And I think this look looks really, really good and makes sunglasses definitely pop when wearing them on face. These sunglasses are made in Japan and they actually say that here in the inner right temple of sunglasses. They say Maui Jim and then they give the lens size in the bridge width and then they say made in Japan. And if you take a look here at the outside uh, right ear rest, we can see they do have Maui Jim engraved into the titanium frame of the sunglasses here on that outside right ear rest. If you take a look here at the inner left temple sunglasses, they say uh, flowing seas and then they give the model number and then at the end of that, they actually say titanium because like I said, these are titanium frames. Now the sunglasses also feature fully adjustable titanium nose rests and through these metal nose rests we can actually see a laser etched Maui Jim bird logo here on the nose rest for authentication purposes and that's a really cool touch and also looks really really good. I always enjoy the really fine details that optical companies etch on their frames. I think that really makes them feel more premium. Now as far as build quality goes and durability, I'm not sure how good these are going to you know hold up through the test of time. I actually got these in the mail brand new again customized directly from Maui Jim and the frames actually already had a couple little scratches that probably aren't going to 
show up on camera too well. But we'll go ahead and give it a shot anyways. If you guys can see here, there's a little bit of a scratch right there. And again, it came to me like this directly from Maui Gym. It came with a little scratch, which is definitely a little bit annoying. And then also the inner right ear rest right here, it's probably very hard for you guys to see, but it is scratched and the paint came off just a little bit. And again, this was actually shipped to me like this. Maui Gym actually shipped this pair out to me uh, directly from them with these, you know, build quality defects. So I definitely am not happy about that. And again, you really have to look pretty close to notice it, but once you notice it, you kind of can't stop noticing it. And it kind of just looks like that gold plating wore off a little bit. So I'm not really sure what happened there. Uh, these were custom made. So maybe the person who was putting the lenses in this pair of sunglasses uh, messed up and dropped them or something. So I guess it is what it is, but I figured I'd mention that on the review anyways, even though this only uh, has to do with my particular experience and probably won't have to do with your particular experience. Now, as far as pricing goes, these definitely aren't cheap. They come in at $429 for the MSRP of these sunglasses, and usually it's pretty hard to find any good deals on Maui Gym sunglasses, so that's probably what you're going to pay if you do want to pick up a pair of these sunglasses. Now, usually Maui Gym sunglasses cost around $250 to $300, so you have sunglasses like the Maui Gym Tail Slide for $250, and then the Maui Gym Mavericks or Breezeway for around $300, and those sunglasses also do have an aviator style with titanium frames. And I also have the Maui Gym Compass that were very expensive coming in at $329. So $29 more than those Breezeway or Maverick sunglasses. And I thought those were pretty expensive, but they felt really good in the quality. It was very, very good on those frames. So it seemed like it was worth that extra $29. However, these are an extra $100 on top of those Maui Gym Compass sunglasses. And unfortunately, after experiencing these for over a week, I really don't understand why these cost that much more money than a normal pair of Maui Gym sunglasses do. Again, these frames are completely made out of titanium, but again, the Mavericks and the Breezeway and the Cliff House are, and again, all those are $300. So I'm really not sure these cost an extra hundred plus dollars from a pair of Maui Gym Mavericks to produce, but Maui Gym's pricing is usually pretty good as far as the more fancier and the harder sunglasses to produce and the more expensive a pair is to produce, the more expensive they are on Maui Gym's website. However, again, these are coming in at $429, which is very, very steep in my opinion. I think if these sunglasses came in with a price tag of around $350, I think you could justify these being a little bit more expensive than something like the Maui Gym Compass. And I think that would be a good price for these, but again, that really expensive price of $429, I'm really not sure why they cost that much. But with all that being said, I really do love the looks of these sunglasses. I think they look really, really good on my face and they are very unique. And I guess because they're so expensive, you're probably not going to see too many people wearing these sunglasses out. I also do like how you can completely customize a pair of Maui Gym sunglasses for free directly on their website. So that also is really nice. And as far as coverage from sun goes, these are going to offer pretty decent coverage from sun, but nothing too crazy because they do have that square style to them. So as you guys can see here up top, uh, we do have some gaps with sunlight in under protected and then here on the sides again there is gaps to sunlight in unprotected so these are more a stylish pair of sunglasses than they are practical Every pair of Maui Gym sunglasses does have polarized lenses, and they also, of course, offer 100% UVA and UVB protection. And a lot of people regard Maui Gym's lenses to be the best in the world. Personal makes some really beautiful glass lenses, so does Randolph, and Randolph also does make some very nice lightweight polymer glasses. Those are all kind of top tier as far as lens quality goes. But if you're looking for something that's considerably better than Maui Gym's lenses, you're not gonna find it. They are some of the best in the industry. So overall, I really do like this pair of sunglasses. However, there are a couple of downsides, like those small little scratches that came to me directly from the factory. And also the fact that this bridge here up top has a bend to it, and I don't think it's supposed to. I actually think it looks pretty good with the little curve here. You know, it's nice and universal, but on the website, again, it's straight. So I don't think it's supposed to have that curve. So that again, doesn't feel premium. That doesn't feel like it's worth $429. So unfortunately with this pair of sunglasses, Considering the price and considering the build quality, I think Maui Gym actually missed the mark on these. I don't think they're worth $429. And again, I do love Maui Gym sunglasses and I have a huge collection of them. But as far as this particular pair goes, I think you're better off spending your money towards another pair of Maui Gym sunglasses. Probably gonna wanna steer away from these. But that's all I got for you guys in this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give me a big thumbs up down below. And of course, make sure to hit the subscribe button and then you'll be notified every single time I put a brand new video just like this one to my YouTube channel. Again, thank you all so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one.